So, anyone want to go look at some caves? <laughs> Yes, welcome back to Never Seen, a series where I watch films I've never seen before and tell you what I think about them. Simple really, isn't it? And this one, we're watching The Descent. Why haven't I watched The Descent before? You ask someone, hey, have you seen The Descent? And then they tell you everything. It looks great, it's the best, it's amazing, you should watch it. And then you ask other people and they say, eh, it was alright, looked a bit meh was a bit meh, nah. story was meh, so you never know what to go and watch. I want your predictions in the comment section. Is The Descent a good film? Let us know, but for now, got the film ready? We're going to be watching The Descent, boys. So let's do this. <laughs> Why do I laugh at these things? That's a shame. <sighs> yeah. Sick. So, uh, I've watched The Descent. And it's, um. It looks beautiful. Can't knock any of the performances. It was alright. It was it was a good tell. Good, it was a good film to watch. Cons. Story's a bit basic. A group of girls go into a cave and. Do we ever get told what these things are? It's left up to your imagination, but I think anyone can tell they're Wendigos. When it comes to the characters and the film itself, Juno, did she get what she deserved? I mean, to be fair, she was clearly having an affair with Sarah's husband, I think it's Sarah, and she was a bit of a dick, leading them to a cave that they had no idea where they were, and there was no way they could be found because she lied about everything. Good one, Juno. Did she get what she deserved? When it comes to the monsters of the film, the Wendigos, yeah, I liked it. It's good to see a Wendigo now and then. For those of you who don't know what a Wendigo is, I'll just tell you quickly, a Wendigo is what happens when a person is driven to cannibalism when left abandoned and their body just mutates and becomes a Wendigo. It's cool. They don't tell you that's a Wendigo, but Wendigos can't see you unless you move. They can only hear you like a bat. But they never say, oh, it's a Wendigo. They just say, oh, it's like a bat, and it's this, and this, and this. But no, um, performance-wise, it was good. Story-wise, Juno is a dick. But I've always thought I was going to give it a quick result. It was a good film. Um, story, pretty basic, but shot fantastically. So story-wise, I'd give it 2.5. It was a very simple story stretched out, but it was an enjoyable story to watch. Give it a 2.5 for story, I'd give it a 4. For execution, 6.5, The Descent is good in my books. This next one, the only time I hear of this word is related to Batman. So I'm looking forward to it. I reckon it's got nothing to do with Batman though, has it? <laughs> Juno, get fucked, mate. <laughs> 